this water does. People died trying to find it. You entered the cave. You must have found what was left of Lithi's water. I did. Oh, I... Oh, have mercy and let me have just a sip. I lost my wife in Tartaros and her screams still haunt me in my dreams. Please, put them to rest. Well, I guess it can't hurt. But just a sip. Someone else needs this. think it matters. Got the water. Now to bring it to Ekati's contact.
on high alert here. This looks like the place. You're the contact Ikati described. Do you have Lithia's water? I do, but what's so special about it? I saw a man lose himself after just one sip. Humans here drink Lithia's water to forget their past lives and reincarnate back into the world of the living. But Persephone won't let any of us leave Elysium so long as she's trapped here too. I lost my soulmate. I can't go back in time, but I can forget that pain. Now, give me the water. Here, drink this. For you, my poor Theron. I'll join you in mindless bliss. I must say, I feel a touch woozy. Ugh. How am I going to get you to Adonis now?
What happened to her? She took a sip of Lithi's water. I gave her the last vial. What? Why would you do that? She didn't want to be sentenced to eternal heartbreak after losing her love in Elysium. That I can understand, at least. She mentioned her lover's name, Theron. The silver tongue son? I suppose since he couldn't be saved. Still, watch your back with the Gatti, Cassandra. She can't be trusted. I've already received word that you accomplished just what I asked. Good. And what did you ask Cassandra to do for you? Persephone. Rumor has it Lethe's water has once again entered circulation in Elysium. Don't you dare try to talk your way out of this. You are the only person who knows what Lethe's water means to me. I'm sorry. You would never understand the intricacies of a divine creation like Lethe's water. But I won't forget what part you played here. Persephone, I, I was only trying to- I'll be watching you more closely from now on, friend. This wasn't about helping Adonis at all. You knew that woman would be no use to the rebellion after drinking the water. The woman did promise her help. That wasn't a lie. As for my motives, I've told you from the start they are mine alone to know. But if humans so desperately desire to move on from their pasts, Persephone shouldn't make that choice for them. From what I've seen, nothing good comes from drinking that water. I wasn't asking for your opinion on the matter. I need some time alone, away from your mindless chatter. How may I help you? Come back anytime.
If I can help you again, let me know. Welcome to the Uprising. These ruins were abandoned when Persephone constructed her paradise. We won't be bothered here. But there are so few of you. Most of Persephone's army consists of mind-controlled humans. Free their minds and bring them to me. We can use them as troops. Free their minds? My dear friend Hermes is a master manipulator. And that staff of yours looks like one of his creations. Try using that. There's an outpost southwest from here, nestled in the hand of Hades. Warriors were spotted in its paw. You look concerned. I'm worried about Persephone. I haven't been here long, but I've already heard people want her overthrown. You have? What do these humans expect from her? I'd heard some of the more ungrateful del- These uh, ungrateful delinquents, could they be right? Bah, you give them too much credit. Still. Persephone needs protection. Don't look at me. There's a friend of mine and your father's, Kiros of Zarax. He's a strong and honorable warrior. He's been abducted, but if we could free him... You're suggesting we make a human Persephone's bodyguard? With Kiros at the ready. The humans will think twice before attacking one of their own. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you were in love with Persephone. No one understands her the way I do. Avani sees a cruel despot. To her husband, she's a trinket on his arm. And what do you see? Me? Oh, ah, I don't know. I've never had anyone ask me before. She's... Uh, everything. How do you know this, Kiros? He was an aide, of sorts, to your father. Every great painter needs a hand to crush their pigment. That was Kiros, a warrior. Say no more. I'll find Kiros for you. Ah, I knew I could trust you. While you're gone, I'll arrange a meeting with Persephone. Bring Kiros to the heart of Elysium. We'll be there.
Let's hope no one notices me here. Of Zarax. Hermes sent me. That key making is predictable. I'll give him that much. Now it's mine. Ah, that right? That makes us family. I knew the man well. I heard. This way. Persephone is waiting. Persephone herself? All right, Kiros. Let's make this quick. You said this is going to be easier than you thought. Since we're basically family, I'm trusting your honor. I work for Adonis. But you are caged by humans. Yes, and Hermes found out about it. Right around the time Persephone was coaxed into deciding she needs a bodyguard. You staged the whole thing and you're using Hermes to infiltrate Persephone's lair? You're no simple warrior. Before I met your father, I had four sons. Each a warrior. When my third boy fell in battle, there was only guilt. I'd cried all my tears for the first two. Go on. And with the fourth? I felt longing. Sadness had become my only friend. And I had no one left to grieve. Warriors don't bring peace. They bring sorrow. So by getting behind Persephone's defenses, you think you can prevent war? You could convince her to surrender or distract her while Adonis escapes. Anything but battle. But before we go to Persephone, I have to send confirmation this plan worked. Will you take me? Fine, but be quick. We need to go to Persephone and Hermes. They're waiting. Do you really think you can save lives? I'm not sure how death works in Elysium, but suffering is eternal. And that is something I can't stop. for you. 
all of them. Let's keep moving. Once I thought this here's my plan work, maybe you will stand down. Hurry, Kyrus. We need to get back to Hermes, or Persephone might suspect something. I hear Persephone likes to test her new recruits, and I've got a bit of a temper. If you see me turning right... I'll think of something. you been? No one keeps Persephone waiting. Kiros delayed us. Ask him. I... I'd been locked up for ages. You know how our queen feels about filth. I didn't want her judging us, judging you for being unpresentable. Explain it to Persephone. She's waiting. I'll make sure she knows this was entirely my fault, not yours. I'm sorry I was ungrateful. Kiros will make a strong guard. Thank you again, friend. Here, Hermes. Keeper, I've been robbed. <laughs> 